testing out all our gear. <laughs> so from here, still here, yeah, up to Bayandai, and now we are here. So this is where we are right now, mm -hmm. and we're crossing over to Olkamai. Yeah. This is where we start Oops. our journey Oops. tomorrow, right? The open house. Nice. nice. But, uh, because <laughs> so we have actually arrived at Lake Baikal. We're kind of on the edge of it now. So land is over there and then we're actually on the lake now. As you can see, there's actually a ship in the distance that's been frozen to the lake. <laughs> so we're gonna drive this way for probably I think half an hour to get some lunch, some dinner and then we go on to our final lodge before we start the journey tomorrow so it's been interesting to drive all this way and actually really just see what Siberia is like the actual Siberia out in the wilderness villages huts houses they all seem to be made of wood and obviously it's very cold and snowy but it's very beautiful a lot of this land around just is very untouched but it is very strange that we're walking on a lake yeah in probably another two to three months this will actually be a lake and it'll be quite warm here see the ship in the distance Nice. Yeah. How's that feeling? Yeah, it's not too bad actually. The wind's horrendous. Like it's gonna be killer with that wind if it's if it stays the same. Because it's very gusty, but yeah. I'll, I'll just have to get used to it. It just affects the ball. Um, but yeah, it's not too bad actually. at the start of the journey we're at Cape Havoy which is at the end of Oakland Island and this is the start of our journey across to the other side of Lake Baikal let's go
you getting on? Good, first day. I think we're, well, maybe halfway through. I'm not sure exactly where we are. It's very hard to get a perspective because it's just miles and miles and miles of ice and snow. I see a bit of land, but this is just like ice everywhere. It's, uh, it's a little bit like being back in the Sahara, but a lot colder and a lot snowier. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to really push on. I think I'm making good good speed with uh, with my traveling with the ball. Uh, we did the record attempt this morning and uh, we actually, well, I think we did it. We managed to get 4.77 kilometers within an hour and the current record was 4.3. But our plan now is to get to the ice camp where we're gonna stop off for tonight and sleep on the ice, which is uh, gonna be a lot of fun. But I hear there's a plunge pool with ice where I can actually swim which will help my legs massively. So I'm really hoping that we can get there with enough time before the sun goes down. So I am quite hot, mm. but if I stop for more than 10, 15 minutes, you do feel the cold. Um, but the main thing is there's no wind, which is just a joy. Just enjoy it. So, yeah. yeah, it's not bad. We got to... it's great, yeah. so big. <laughs> <laughs> wow, just just the right fit. Do you think you could do the challenge in them tomorrow? 100% that's the plan. Oh, wow. this is so this stunning, is, isn't this it? Is so we're actually gonna go for... We've just arrived about 20 minutes ago, had a bit of food, and then we're actually going for a sauna and then an ice sort of swim, so. Hot and cold. Don't know about a swim. Yeah, more of a dip. <laughs> um, <laughs> you can really feel the cold now, but this is actually going to help big time with the whole recovery process. Wow, look at the hole. Look at this, just walking us in. <laughs> Whoa! <Whoa-ha! laughs> look. Yeah, don't have to go. Down, seat, and flight. Like cold. Oh. <laughs> it's crazy. Do you want to come in? <laughs> yeah. Get those hamstrings stretched. Yes. <sighs> Been preparing for this at home. <laughs> but with frozen peas, it's a little bit different. So cool, man. Super side, actually. Yes, John. <laughs> <laughs> There's a new one. <laughs> That's incredible. Good. Thank you, mate. Oh, wow. So day two, final day of this challenge, I'll be honest. Yesterday I was really, really tired. And today we're hoping to cover more distance, which is why we're setting off a lot earlier. It's a beautiful day. It was very windy this morning, but the wind has subsided. It's a lot colder than when we started yesterday. But uh, yeah, it's time to uh, crack on. and let, Let's get this thing done. <laughs>
we've had to start. Yeah, yeah, Today I'm trying to work in like 5k bits, um, but at 4k on the first, first sort of stint. Um, the back of my left knee is just seized up and it's like really, really painful. I can't even move. So I've had to stop and like massage it out. Um, it's just really horrible. It's like a really horrible pain. So hopefully it's eased off a little bit. So what's going on? I've just had a bit of a rub down, um, <laughs> just on my knee. I've, I've taken ibuprofen. I've tried to do everything I can to keep going because I'm I was in pain, but I feel a little bit lighter actually. It's good to know that we've got supplies in the van, so we're just going to see how it goes. Yeah, man. <laughs> Hey! Oh. Hey! Well done! Oh! <laughs> Idiots! <laughs> yeah. Huh? Yeah, let's see.